check, check this out, check this out. Watch, watch this, though, watch this. Further inquiries. You know, you've got some suspicion of contact and conspiracy to interfere with oh, international infrastructure. I'm not sure where you're hanging. Uh, infrastru interfere with infrastructure. It's that new stupid um, Public Order Act law, isn't it? Interfere with infrastructure. Um, but what about if they're cutting trees down and you're doing a petition to save the trees, but if they're cut down and removed, then there are no longer any trees left to save. So you don't really have anything the case, you know, uh, you, you don't get anything to defend. Um, you know, what right of intervention have you got to protect it if you're legitimately pursuing a case about it? This is the thing. Interfering with infrastructure, the thing is, none of that acts at all, the New Public Order Act, actually says that you're using a political right or you're invoking a political right. It doesn't acknowledge, it, it supposes that whole act is worded, so it supposes that you're just a normal citizen going about business and then you just start interfering with infrastructure. For example, um, you know, guy comes out of a pub um, walks down the road and, you know, goes to, like, some kind of pylon or something that the government uses for communication and just pulls it down, um, you know, and then carries on and goes home. For, you know, not that, um, you know, the, you know, infrastructure. Not actually, um, for example, when those people are climbing up the bridge, you know, they climb onto the bridge and then they kind of, like, put the banners up there on the bridge right? It's not actually preventing traffic from passing on the bridge. Um, and if they're actually doing an advert or promotion. Now, the thing is, adverts and promotions, representations in public, f do fall under the wording of advertisements and a represent making a representation to the public and anything that you need to install that or do to put it. You don't need permission, and the government, if they wanted to, could put up a sign saying, you know, Happy New Year or whatever or on the side of a bridge. And they do do sometimes. So it, it is qualifies, it, it's under the meaning and definitions of these representations, which are class F, and then you can apply the enactment to it. Um, uh, when you get that um, Louise, whatever she was, from Just Stop Oil, I haven't seen much of her recently, although I haven't been following Just Up Oil as closely as I was before, but she went up on the motorway garrison, and I don't know if she had Just Up Oil signs or not, but the motorway garrison sign itself is a sign. <laughs> you know, it is actually a sign which you give notice to the public. They have some New Year message they have some New Year messages on those highway signs authorised. But the thing is you don't need authorization from the government when the law gives you a deemed and express consent. And it also applies in, in the Highways Act, inside of the highways as well. Legally, in law, right, um, if it's anything to do with a sign or notice or message, it can go up beside on your highway. Um, so that, Louise, not interfering with infrastructure, infrastructure either. You're actually invoking the right where you can apply the right. And they're not acknowledging that. They're just acknowledging that, you know, it's a person walking down the road um, who's not using a political right or campaign. And then, I don't know, um, you know, um, I don't know, uses a bulldozer to rip down London Bridge, um, f you know, just for leisure or fun. But, you know, it, it, it and that's... It, even if, and even if, you know... It's meant to be a jurisdictional thing from the magistrates and, and crown courts. That's the, that's the main point. So it, any political cases really should be in the Supreme Court anyway because, you know, that's where pa cases to, related to Parliament are heard. But anyway... You're outside at the moment. Morning, this is not under arrest. I'm making some further inquiries. You had to, you had to think about that, didn't you? I'm making some... Um, how can I put this, you know, without upsetting you? Um, further inquiries, well, he's going to upset him, he's going to put handcuffs on him. Conspiracy to interfere with international infrastructure. 
Yeah, but it's political rights are plight, and then there's this locking on business, you know, and so forth. You haven't locked onto a bike, well, it's locked onto um, a, a, a bike lock, onto a bench. That the, the Public Order Act is not worded um, to actually acknowledge that you're even doing a political campaign. They're not acknowledging that he's using a political right or campaign at the moment. They're treating him as um, just a bloke who's done something, not a bloke who's using a right. And that act, um, you can claim the right in that act, but they're, they're supposing that you're getting charged because you're not using the right or you're not invoking the right. That's like what I mean to say. You're outside at the moment. Morning, this is not under arrest. I'm making some... Further inquiries. You have got suspicion of not taking conspiracy to interfere with oh, international infrastructure. I'm not sure where you're handcuffed now. Unfortunately, I don't make the law. Are you gonna? Yeah, unfortunately, I, I, I don't make I don't make the law. Unfortunately, I don't make the law, but I break it a lot. Hey, I'm a police officer. Unfortunately, um, I don't make the law, but I break it every day. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't make the law, but I break it a lot. Um, you know. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't make the law. Well, we're making laws now because we're getting the government to make and change the law. Um, we're involved in a case to get public support um, and promoting this matter um, by putting a big sign up on the side of London Bridge, you know, um, which we're entitled to legally do. Uh, as long as we don't, um, you know, if we want to put ourselves at risk, um, we're entitled to do that, you know. This is the thing. You know, um, just like the police put himself at risk when he's you know, tearing down the motorway at 500 mile an hour, trying to stop a car that's brakes won't work, you know, because the electric's gone in it or something. You know, this is the thing with the police. Um, unfortunately, I don't make the law, but I break it a lot. Uh, and I can see you're doing that as well, but I'm the one with the, anch I'm one, I'm one with the handcuffs and you're not. I'm, I'm one with the, little, with, with the Brady Bunch. I'm, I'm, I'm the one with the muscle and you're not. And you're the one who's just stood there letting me arrest you. Oh, no, it's, it's you know, resisting arrest now. Oh, we've got more offences where that came from. But but you can't use but you, that offence can't come from anywhere because I'm not breaking the law. I'm immune from it, you know. Oh, that old chestnut, that old Bill, the old Bill, the old, that old Bill, you know. <laughs> we're, we're the ones pursuing the international um, climate criminals here, you know, um, but they don't want to entertain that. And then, oh, if you start getting ideas like, oh, no, we might need our own force. We need some force. Oh, oh is it standing army now, is it? Oh, no, you can't do that. We'll have to get the police helicopters in and the, the armed squad if you're going to start, you know. It's not peaceful protesting anymore. Um, well, you know, not peaceful policing anymore, is it? You know, it's um, aggravated policing, you know, I illegal policing. Th this is the thing. The police is to the rights that are being used. The police is the alien in this situation. It's the anomaly, right? When these laws were made in 1688, which is way after 1661, and even way after Magna Carta, when these rights are made, right, you know, 1688, 1700, all the way through 100 years, all the way through to... Um, nine, uh, 1900, sorry, 1688, uh, 1700, all the way through to 1800, and then 18, 10, 20, 30, 40. Oh, now we've got a police force. Um, we're using laws and rights that are still in effect where there wasn't a force, a police force. They, they had constable. Um, you know, and, and sometimes they had groups of people who, who were hired out. But you, you and if someone broke the law and offended you, you could pursue prosecuting them and also even pay kind of like what you would call rookie um, for hire police or for hire investigator um, to help you, right? So what you'd have is you would be hiring the police to work for you, to apprehend the criminal, and then to prosecute them. Or once they found them, then they'd take them to the sheriff, right? So you'd actually have your own hired police, right? Working for your cause or campaign, or or, your, or, or, or if someone offended you, a crime against you, to, to try and um, solve it, right? 
And now what we've got is a, 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 a an army, a standing army that, that serves Keir Starmer. Now it's like, yes, care, no care, free bags, full care. That's not impartiality. It's a political party, as far as I'm concerned, right? And that's the problem. You're outside at the moment. We're not under arrest. I'm making some further inquiry. Not under arrest, but we've got all of you, um, you know, it's charades. Let's play charades. Does anyone know this one? You know, it's charades. You know, anyone know this one? What's this one? Yeah, okay, just a little, anyone guess? Is that under arrest, that one? No, 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 oh, wrong. Wrong answer, detention. <laughs> no, we're searching him. Um, oh, you, you know, we've been searched. Oh, it looks like arrest to me. You're not under, you know, at the moment, you're not under arrest. We're just searching you. I'm detaining you. It's rather a suspicion of partaking of conspiracy to interfere with oh, King National Institute. Suspicion? Well, I mean, you didn't figure it out yet. You know, he's a, he's going to make detective that guy. Ain't he? We suspect you're under you're under suspicion of interfering with infrastructure. Well, so you're not char you know uh, you're not arrested for interfering with in infrastructure. We suspect that you have been. We're not quite sure yet, but I'm going to make detective one day. Not sure where you're handcuffed now. Unfortunately, mate, I never make the ball. Who are you, are you going to arrest him? I'm not sure why he's just standing there and letting him handcuff him. You know, if it'd been like Schwarzenegger, he'd, he'd like poof poof nutted that woman there. Then he'd, then he'd like you know, the hell, you know, it's poof poof. You know, but you know. You know, if you want to hand over your, you know, well earned, you know, twelve pound sixty to go watch Arnold do it, you know, show show us how it's done, Arnold. You know, I'll be back. You know, show us how it's done, Arnold. Doof, doof, doof. There's one man, one man against the odds. No, no, there's eighty two people sat outside court with signs holding up, you know, defend our juries or whatever. You know, one man, Arnold. You know, can make a difference. You know, just stand there. You know. You know, lay back and think of England. You know, take me, take me, you know. <laughs> take, you know, so this is a peaceful, you know, Extinction Rebellion dedicated to peaceful, non-violent actions, you know. Um, you know, just, just stand there, you know, and... Um, <laughs> if you decide, like, like, the street. You're outside right at the moment. We're mm. not under arrest. I'm making some... Further inquiries. We have a suspicion of partaking of conspiracy to interfere with oh, international infrastructure. I'm not sure where you're handcuffed now. Unfortunately, mate, I never make the law. Were you, were you Fortunately, I never make the law. Well, mate, well, you should start. You should start trying to make it. Write a petition up. Officer, unfortunately, I never make the law. Well, why don't you draft a bill then and propose it to Parliament, you know? The... Um, requirement for the police to recognise rights act. Oh, isn't that already in the criminal procedure rules in part one, two, uh, D, you know, um, you know, um, you know, the needs of other cases, you know, we're, 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 we're doing a public demonstration. Do you mind the needs of other cases? No, you're interfering with infrastructure. No, actually I'm putting a big sign up on the side of London bridge. Um, I think it'll probably, um, help promote the campaign. Quite well. I have deemed an express consent. You know, um, you know, David Cameron. You know, um, he banged a sign up um, somewhere around the. You know, when he was prime minister, he can do it once. You know, I've got the authority of the law. Unfortunately, I don't make the law. Yes, you break it enough. You know, you were you arresting me for. You're gonna arrest me if you're outside at the moment. We're not under arrest. 